Upon launching Bamboo Studio, you'll notice Login Register option in the upper left corner. Selecting this will prompt a new window where you can sign in. If you're a new user, you can create an account by following the on-screen instructions. However, if you previously set up an account during your printer setup, you can log into the same credentials. Google, Facebook, and Apple logins are also available. Moving to the Device tab, you'll find a list of printers linked to your account, along with the current status and connectivity details. We will delve deeper into the functionalities of the Device tab in an upcoming video. Shifting our focus to the Prepare tab in the upper left corner. This is where you can select a specific printer you intend to use, as well as the appropriate build plate installed in the printer. There is an array of build plates to choose from. Cool plates are optimal for PLA printing, while engineering plates are suitable for PETG, ABS, TPU, PA, and PC. The smooth PEI plate, a high temperature plate, is compatible with the broadest range of materials encompassing both cool and engineering plates. Lastly, the textured PEI plate ensures exceptional first layer adhesion for prints and provides a textured surface finish. Pairing the correct plate with the material you're utilizing is crucial for achieving a successful print with perfect first layers. If the plate is not accurately selected to what is on the printer, adhesion issues would likely to happen causing failed prints. Beneath the build plate selection, you'll find the filaments synced from your printer. Those within AMS will be able to view the various filaments that are loaded in your printer. In a subsequent video, we will cover filament profile settings and how to create custom ones if you are using third-party filaments. In our next tutorial, we will discuss the process of importing 3D models into Bamboo Studio, as well as learn about the types of 3D files you will most likely encounter.